Another exciting night of basketball, a big a big District 12 matchup playing out on the court between the R Redeemers Knights and Bishop Ryan Lady Lions, both teams undefeated in the district. We head to the Lions Den for all the action. First quarter, Bishop Ryan's Maggie Rovig with the steal takes it to the other end. She's going to step back and drain a big three right there. Lady Lions really showing off tonight. Look at this move by Tochi Udekwe. Pauses right before bouncing it off the backboard. They're up now by four. Second quarter, Knights trailing Aubrey Greedel finds Maya Bevedo, and she finds the net for three. They're down by half a dozen now, but the Lions got to protect their den. Sydney Upton from outside the arc. Her three-pointer extends this lead, and the Lady Lions take down the Knights. 41-28 the final. The undefeated Garrison Lady Troopers hosting the Kenmare Honkers. Second quarter, Lady Troopers up by 11. Off a of steal, Sweet Cedar Perkins gets the easy layup, forcing Kenmare to call a timeout. Perkins finishes the game with 21 points. Garrison's defense showing up big tonight, causing another turnover. Mia Gehring long pass to Kara Scheller, and she gets the layup. Lady Troopers now up 15 after the break. Honkers, though, not going down without a fight. Brooklyn Roden with the deep two, hoping to give her team some life. Garrison wins big 66 to 48. The South Prairie Royals hosting the DLB Lakers. Third quarter, Royals trailing Ajaya Trader. Bounce pass to Summer Kresbach. That's off the backboard, and it's a two point game now. On the other end, DLB's Madison Lauf with the jumper for two, and she absolutely dominated on the court tonight. DLB on the other side, Kaylee Werner, she's going to get the steal. Long pass right here to Lauf. She stops just enough to get control, and that basket takes their lead to eight. And the Lakers win by a dozen, 44-32 the final. Some boys action also tonight. Max hosting New Salem Almont. Second quarter, Holsteins with a five-point lead. Ryland Supier misses the three, but Wyatt Kuhn goes up, gets the rebound and the basket. Off a turnover now, feed to the other end. Kuhn, this time Weston Kuhn gets the fadeaway jumper, extending the Holsteins lead to nine. Max down 12 now, out of a timeout. Ashton Yellowbird with the pull-up jumper for two, cutting the lead down to 10, and the Holsteins win 62-43. The Garrison Troopers on the road facing the Central McLean Cougars. Troopers win 55 to 48. The Powers Lake Ranchers hosting the Mandaree Warriors. Ranchers with a big win at home, 82-52. Let's take a look at some more girls basketball scores from around the region. Class A basketball, the Minot Majets win on a half-court shot by eighth grader Maggie Fricky. That's going to be on this week's top play, so you're definitely not going to want to miss that one. Back to Class B girls, Botno Stars hosting TGU Titans, Stars win 64-50. Ned Rose Cardinals hosting the Drake Animus Raiders, Cardinals win. Glenburn Panthers taking on the Surrey Mustangs, Glenburn wins on the road. The MLS Mavericks hosting the Lewis and Clark Bombers, Mavericks win at home. Wrapping up the girls, the Powers Lake Ranchers beat the Mandaree Warriors 49-26, the final.